Now, until we all put our heads together collectively, become responsible citizens, dedicated citizens, trustworthy citizens, transparent leaders, and role models to the future generation who will fail as a nation. So first of all, if we do not change that concept of mindset, no matter the leader that will be president of the Republic of Ghana will fail. Because we will contribute to that failure instead of contributing to building our nation. And leaders too must be very, very transparent. Periodically, as leader, as president of the Republic of Ghana, you need to let the Ghanaian citizen know the state of the nation, the true state of the nation, not the political state of the nation. My leadership will patronize Ghana and Ghanaian first for this country to grow. <laughs> Policy number three, that in order to know your people, you need to have what is called a national data system. We do not have a national data system. Then APC and Hassel Ergal intend to rule what is called a national data system and base. That means that every Ghanaian from now on when I become president, from your property, your facial recognition, your data, your businesses, your bank accounts, your blood group, everything about you will be taken into consideration. I am going to build a country driven by data, the struggling we are having with Ghana voters, ID card, and EC. You don't need to struggle with that anymore. When you turn 18, you'll be home and you'll get a letter that go to this office and then register to become a voter. Nobody is looking for you anywhere to bring you. You will go there automatically because systems are working, institutions are working.